Welcome back, everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to Akiva's trip. I just let these two guys speak on accident. Because <laughs> I kind of checked my recording. And I noticed the sound was a bit off. So I just increased the game sound a bit. Put my mic down just a little bit. So it should be better now. Uh, so anyway, they said, So what you're saying is those recent news reports of people being discovered in deeply lethargic states? That's what they said. That's what Yudo said as a blue guy. It's because they've been attacked by these... synthesters? I'm afraid so. I think I understand! This is one of those truth is stranger than fraction things, right? That would be fiction, Cotty. Truth is stranger than fiction. So let me get this straight. You go off to apply for some shady as hell job where your employer somehow drugs you and turns you into a monster? And nothing leading up to that set off a red flag. You are seriously the world heavyweight champion of dumbass. Come on, Toko. He's been through enough already. Yeah. <laughs> Besides, getting lured in by Ellie Swag makes total sense, considering who we're talking about. I'm a sucker for a pretty figurine. Oh, for the love of... Do you even comprehend how much trouble you've caused everyone? You don't exist in a vacuum, you know. <laughs> I yield! <laughs> uh. Oh god. What am I going to say here? Well, that's the way the cookie crumbles. So, ignoring these two for the moment, <laughs> I believe introductions are in order. I'm Yuto, Yuto Tachibana. May I have your name as well? Mine is Shizuku. Shizuku Tokikaze. As I said before, there's a lot of dialogue in this game. We call ourselves the Akiba Freedom Fighters. Together, we voluntarily patrol the streets of Akihabara, keeping an eye out for trouble. He's one of us as well, and this bar serves as our base of operations. That's right! And I'm one of the central figures in our illustrious group. Name's Kaito Tachibana, and the pleasure's mine. As you might have figured out, I'm Yuto's older twin brother. Best way to tell us apart? I'm the one with all the ideas. Is one of those ideas being out of school and unemployed? You shut up! You shut up and you die! Little brothers can't show up, big brothers. It's against the rules. Yes, yes, that's enough now. I'm Kati Raikkonen. I blew on in from Finland to Japan so I could see and do its cool busy culture. <laughs> hmm? I believe what she's trying to say is that she flew here from Finland to study the cool culture of Japan. Name's Kihachi Sugiyama. I'm the manager of this here game bar, Mogra, where people can knock back a few while they play these old classic arcade cabinets. Feel free to just call me Pops. Everybody else around here does. But you're welcome to call me Dear Sweet Old Man if you prefer. <laughs> He's got a face fit for the FBI's most wanted list, doesn't he? <laughs> hey. But he's a good guy. Don't worry. You could have said that sooner, you know. I'm Toko Sagisaka. I grew up with this dolt and just can't seem to get away from him, despite my best efforts. You're stuck with me. No need for formalities with me. Everybody just calls me by my first name. Incidentally, thanks for saving him. I happened upon him during a mission. It was good fortune, nothing more. There is one other member of our group, but she's like a rare monster spawn. She should pop eventually. Guess you'll meet her then. So, what's the plan? Do we all pile into the police station and tell them Akiba's infested with monsters? They'd never believe a word of it. Why not? I mean, we can show them living proof. You're one of these synthester things now yourself, right? No, no, that's no good. He'd get deceptive and have weird sciencey tests run on him. True. Hmm, so going to the police would involve giving him up as a noble sacrifice. That sounds reasonable. You bastard. Don't even joke about that. Besides, shouldn't we be more concerned with trying to get him back to normal? I mean, if he stays like this, he'll start attacking people sooner or later, right? That should be no concern. 
He will not attack others against his will, at the very least. He... he won't? Well, what do you think? You're the one in the hot seat here. <laughs> Let's look more into these synthesters. Yeah, that's a good call. And we should start by checking out the place where you interviewed. If we were to find clues anywhere, that would be the most obvious spot. Hmm. There's still an awful lot I don't get, though. Like, if there's hard evidence of monsters in Akiba, shouldn't the police already be on it? Until we're certain of that, all we can do is our duty as freedom fighters and investigate. Oh! Hey, Tokikaze! Would you care to help us out with that? What? Well, I mean, you seem pretty familiar with these things. So come on, what do you say? It is true that I've been researching them. But I'm being specifically targeted by them as well. And I don't wish to involve you all in my affairs. <laughs> I think that ship has already sailed. <laughs> no kidding. These creeps have already changed one of our guys into some kind of freaky vampire. Watch your tongue. So yeah, if you can help with that, we ain't gonna stop you. All right. Okay then, perfect. Shizuku, please write your name and cell phone number in the group registry. Cell phone? I'm sorry, I don't have one of those. That's rather unusual in this day and age, but if you don't have a cell number, your email address will do just fine. Um... Well... Hmm. Sounds like you're a tough one to get a hold of. I guess it would be kind of awkward to ask for your home number, huh? Actually, I... haven't been home in quite some time. There were problems. Seriously? So you're an honest-to-goodness, real-life runaway? All mired in melodrama? I didn't run away exactly. And I do have a place to stay. A place with plenty of manga. They even have a shower there. Don't tell me you're staying in a manga cafe. Do you not have anywhere else to go? Mm. Hmm. Seems you've got some heavy stuff going on. Pop, you know, the upstairs here is all stark and bare and empty. Hmm? Oh yeah, you're right. I think we got some bedding swirled away around here too. What do you say, Shizuku? If you like, you're free to stay on the second floor here for a spell. And we won't take no for an answer. Meeting you like this feels like it's gotta be more than a coincidence. Know what I mean? Having you around can only be to our benefit if we're to continue studying these monsters. It would seem to be a win for all parties. Then we all agree! The Akiba Freedom Fighters have a new member! Three cheers! I'm wondering, is that a Scott Pilgrim reference? But wait... I haven't agreed to anything. Please, for me. Alright. Just for a little while, though. Thank you for having me. Okay, so here we freedom fighters stand. In the midst of a maelstrom. You said you fought some of these things already. But aside from that, you ever done any real hand-to-hand -hand combat? <laughs> I was forged in the fires of Toko's wrath. I never meant to forge anything. <laughs> you just mean we fight so often you happen to get something out of it, right? <laughs> I'm not sure I'd even call those fights. They seem to be more like tests of endurance to me. Huh? What was that? N nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> Said too much. See, I'm getting a little worried now. Hey, I know. A friend of mine runs a coliseum in Akiba. Or a battle arena, I guess. Whatever you want to call it. Might be a good place to get yourself caught up on the basics of combat. You want, I'll introduce you. For real? What kind of person is this? Who the hell runs a battle <laughs> arena in Akiba? Just a martial arts nut I know who found herself managing the place, that's all. But she doesn't let just anyone step into the ring. You gotta pass some kind of test first or something. I'll give her a call and let her know what's up. 
so you better get going. Oh, and take Shizuku with you, too. A little extra training can't hurt any, right? I think Toko should go with. She can probably force her way in there, no problem. Test be damned. <laughs> Watch your tongue. I am a dainty and respectable lady. You got that? Seriously, rude much? It's not a bad idea, though. So who will you escort to the arena? Shizuku or Toko? I'll go with Toko. What? Why me? I... I guess it makes sense, actually. You go by yourself, and they'll wipe the floor with you. So for your sake, yeah, I'll go along. The battle arena is on the other side of Main Street and right past Junk Street. You got that? Come on, let's get this over with. Knock him dead! <laughs> we will. So I can get to the battle arena through Junk Street. Changing partners. Uh, always be sure to select the most suitable person to your desired ending, as your choices will contribute greatly to the story's conclusion. Good. Ah, do we have a moment? I was wondering if there's anyone you have your eye on. I'm very perceptive in matters of the heart, so I can tell you what your many girls in your life think of you. Please feel free to ask me for an update any time. As you continue on your journey, the con journey, okay, the conversation choices you make will determine how you're regarded, which in turn may affect the story's outcome. So be sure to check back with me from time to time, and always think before you speak. All right, the music's back and loud, and here we are, in Mogra. This is pretty damn awesome. Hi, Doko. You're cool with red hair. Didn't know I could do that. Anyway. Oh. That's my sister's room. I can't go in yet. No! Let's move out. So we got Toko, so we're moving the hell out. Oh, we got a new mail, though. Aye. That's a map. Great. I'm so bad at stuff. Email. Come straight home, no detours. Nana. Everybody's worried about you. I think you should come back straight to base. Don't even stop anywhere, not even be. I think I got that message earlier. Eagerly seeking brave warriors. Ahoy hoy, it's your arena manager, Antoinette. I'm looking for spunky warriors to fight in my arena. Those who consider themselves grapplers or just want to score some winnings, step right up to my open air arena. You know the one. I'll be waiting for you. Let loose and open the floodgates of your desire. And no, I'm not talking about those floodgates. Oh my, star. Okay. Better. Better is a social media tool that's open to the public. Though some days you wish it wouldn't be. Helpful information pops up on Better from time to time, so be sure to keep an eye on it. Otaku have been disappearing. Blah 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 blah. One of these is Nana. I know that. I think Seven Chan is Nana. If I'm not mistaken. I don't know. Anyway, let's move on. There's already enough dialogue in this game, so... I'm not gonna read all the bitter things. Even though they do have some lovely stuff in them. Older woman with a bat. Nah. I can buy stuff in these shops. It's not gonna help me much right now. Huh. Remember when we used to play around here? I don't! I do. I'm lying. I'm sorry. Stop being weird, man. <laughs> here we are. The Battle Arena. Let's on to night. Well, now, it's rare to get customers at this hour. Hmm? Oh, you must be the boy Pops was telling me about. You look rather ordinary to me. But perhaps there's more to you than meets the eye. Oh, where are my manners? I'm the manager of this establishment. You may call me Antoinette. 
While I don't own the arena, the one who does is presently on a journey. So I am in charge for the time being. Now then, let's get started, shall we? This facility exists to help one achieve his or her full potential. It is a place where rivals cultivate each other's growth. Those who win do receive reward money, <laughs> but the true reward is the experience itself. However, not everyone has the heart of a champion. If you wish to stand victorious within this ring, you must first prove yourself worthy. Let's go. I will now test that worth, if I may. Are you ready? <laughs> I was born ready. I'm with him. We're fighting as a duo. As you wish. Please, step into the ring. Huh. Wait till you see what we can do. They said there wasn't a soul in Uchikanda who would dare cross us. Let's do this. Even though my clothes aren't really... desirable. <laughs> I'm salty. I'm like a hobo. <laughs> Pick me up right off the streets. If we're gonna keep fighting these sinister things, we're gonna need a secret weapon. Some technique to make short work of them. So let's get you all trained up, at least enough so you don't get beat down by the damned things. Uh, yeah, chain strip. I know this thing. Let's go. You bastard. Man, I did a lot of damage to him. His head. Good. Got you. Okay. Let's do this. Alright, she's ready to go. Uh, just need her. Oh, come on, I need her. That's good. Let's get ourselves this. Good. Let's get the party started. Chain stripping. The never ending combo. Go your pants, buddy. And you should. Thanks much. Now, be destroyed. <laughs> and there goes their underwear. <laughs> now that's a fatality. <laughs> On the status screen, when your offense is high, you can deal more damage to your enemies. When your defense is high, your clothing is less likely to be ruined during combat. Now I need to pick up stuff. Oh god. No! There's still something there. The strip combo starts high now, the bullet round begins to fade away with one of the button. You can now perform a strip finisher, removing the enemy's underwear via a special cutscene. And underwear doesn't tear easily, so it'll be there for the taking afterward. Which we totally did! <laughs> well done! Though considering who sent you here, I shouldn't be surprised. And you, you're Sagi Sokka's daughter, no? I've heard tell of your mischievous ways for some time, but I never imagined you were so strong. Huh, am I really that well known? Here's your pass. With this, you may come make use of the arena any time you wish. Excellent. Please make this coliseum roar with the flames of your passion. You're very passionate Thank about you this. very much. I'm sure we'll come bug you again real soon. I have some shopping to do on the way back to Mogra, so you go on ahead. I'll see you later. I guess I should head back and tell Pops how I did. At the battle arena, only the strongest can survive. If you've gotten the hang of things, you might want to try facing some tough opponents and see how you do. That's all good. Ah, stuff is still there. Good. Plastic bat. Uh, boxer shorts, white button on with stockings. Need all that good stuff. Uh, well, with that said and done, let's see what kind of new stuff we got. <sighs> Didn't get any headphones. Oh. That seems nicer. 
You are not yet able to wear this. We will be, though. Striped pants. This looks slightly off. <laughs> but I'll take it. Uh, Alright. So we got some boxer shorts. I, get, I guess we'll get that. That's cool. I can dig it. And all the rest is pretty damn bad. Let's get going. The bosses drop pretty good weapons. I expect great things of you, Antoinette. I'm still here, how did you send that? You have considerable skill. I'll be waiting in the arena during normal business hours. So feel free to drop by for a challenge anytime. Here are the basic rules of conduct for your reference. Rules. The arena is ranked based. The more matches you win, uh, the higher you will be ranked. You always will be matched up with fighters of equivalent rank to your own. Victory will earn you monetary rewards. There's no registration fee nor contract required to fight. All you need to bring with you is your burning passion. <laughs> Hot. Something happened. Kichachi Sugiyama. I'll tell you the details in person. So come on back to the bar as soon as you're done with your training. Honestly, I would like to keep fighting a little bit more in order to get money and stuff. I think that will help make the game a little bit easier. Uh, yeah, and in order to fight her, I think you need to beat the entire arena. That's what I like to see. At this arena, I'll have you compete in three consecu consecutive battles. The winner moves on to the next round. There's no timeouts in a real fight. You cannot leave the ring during a match. Be careful, alright? Once the current rank is F. Are you ready? I need a bit more time, because I need to save. I keep a lady waiting. Hearts. Visual editor. What? Oh. R really? Oh. I guess that's cool. I didn't know that was a possibility. I don't think we had that on the freaking, uh... PS3. New data. Let's save. Right. Uh, with that saved, all is good. Check your status. Light Otaku. <laughs> I deserve a battle title in that. My strip skills are so low. This is embarrassment. Dude! You keep doing what you're doing. So I'm not gonna do that right now. I'm just gonna head back to Mogra. And I'm pretty sure there's a way to fast travel. Uh, well, let's check some stores. Welcome. Yeah, I know the store stuff. Let's see what you got. Uh, that's just food, which I don't really Thank need. You very much. I need, like, a store that sells computers and stuff. Perhaps a poster. I used to build a poster in the beginning. Like this giant-ass poster that just <laughs> kicked ass. I don't remember where I got it. This guy has a laptop, it's way too much money. Thank you very much. Uh, please go, man. Maybe, maybe, not sure yet. Welcome. Uh, same stuff, is that? Thank you very much. Sure. Well then, with all shopping aside, let's first continue the story and unlock some more stuff. I guess we'll be fine for now. I mean, at least I don't look like a hobo anymore. <laughs> That's a great improvement! And I shouldn't be shouting into the microphone. That's generally a bad thing to do. You're a shopkeeper. Okay. All this talking stuff to me. You're selling stuff. What are you selling? Red character t shirt. Uh, well, it's got 25 durability. But I think it has better stuff you can buy somewhere for a little bit more money. Now you can buy a suit that's pretty expensive, but it's pretty kick ass when it comes to its defense and durability stuff. Oh, yeah, the flyers. Gimme. I need those. 
Uh, yeah, they'll give out flyers. Yeah, they're, they're flyers. Those are collectibles, kinda. They're real life flyers from Akiba. So, it's pretty cool, to be honest. So, I'm going to try to collect as many things as possible. Uh, let's get back to Mogra. Continue the story. And listen to some awesome music again. Hey, welcome back. So how'd it go? That Antoinette's a bit of an odd one, ain't she? Not a bad person to know, though. Next time you see her, give her my regards. Anyway, I got a question for you. When you were walking down Junk Street, you saw some suspicious people milling about, right? If you got some energy to spare, I'd like you and Shizuku to head back there and scope the place out. <laughs> when I get back, I'm going to eat so much. Man, you that hungry? I sent Toko out chopping, er, chopping, <laughs> not some few minutes ago. Is there any food you want to add to the list? Tell her to buy me... Yeah, tell her to buy me three of the usual. Get it, got it, good. I'll call her and let her know. Okay, we're off to patrol Junk Street. We'll be back soon. Okie dokie. Go get them, but be careful. Junk Street has all those tight cramped roads behind the Bell Hall assembly hall. Definitely some shady people back there. Let's get to some shady people. Or watch. TV stuff. Oh, Saneko. Okay. Asleep. Too bad I can't go with Togo. Oh, wait. I got mail. Huh. I got mail. Indian to the right, Curry coming soon. Full steam ahead. The sup. The sup. The. Learn to talk, you idiot. The superest of super curry restaurants is opening in Akihabara shortly. Taste the fullest, boldest set of authentic Indian spices in Japan. But get here quickly, because once people find out about this place, there's no doubt people will be lining up around the block to see what the fuss is all about. That was total bull. And I loved it. Sis! Damn you! Need to get in there. Oh well. I need better shoes. I love it. <laughs> I hear this freaking commercial like so many times right now. <laughs> oh my god. It's ridiculous. I think those are the are shitty those people. the suspicious people Pop spoke of? I think so. The hell's your problem? What do you think you're looking at? Whoa, buddy. You here to start something? I'll make mitts meat out of you both! They're synthesters. I can sense it. I'm afraid we have no choice but to defeat them. I've got your back. Let's do this. <laughs> she smiled. All you really need to know is that there exists a technique called counter. And it sort of just happened on some now. When your attack buttons is pressed at the right time moment during a defensive stance, it may result in a devastating devastating counterattack. Time it just right and boom. Bam! Right in the cotton polyester blend. <laughs> the area you strike when counterattacking is the term by which button you press. It is not necessary to match the enemy's attack. These are the default controls. Yeah, okay. Countering an enemy's attack, a counter strip maneuver may be triggered automatically if the corresponding attack is low enough their ability. Counter strip, yeah, good. Uh, intentionally, yeah, sure. Haha! <laughs> Taste my monitor! A vengeance! That's right! Ow! 
That hurt. Perk. Let's try to get a combo going again. Earned a new nickname. Nice. I think I damaged her enough. Yeah, I did. No, not her. This guy, girl, whatever. Don't know what you are. Daft Punk? Probably. Let's do this, man. Give me everything. Let's finish it. <laughs> Get owned. If you get the stuff, yeah, you finish it. You got some sneakers out of this. Good. That was awesome. This is going well. There don't seem to be any more of them. No. We all burned them. Okay, let's head back and tell Pops what happened. Oh, it's awesome. And we got some new stuff out of this. So let's see. Oh, well, that's good that the dress is so strong. The riding suit is weaker, really? Anything that's better? No, it's just the girl stuff that's better. Anything else is worse. Military boots. I'll take the black sneakers. They suit my entire black outfit. I now have these. Blue checkered boxers. Or boxer shorts. Blue checkered boxers. I'll take the boxer shorts. Uh, let's see. No better weapons? Oh well. I guess the monitor's pretty OP then. Though not as OP as the uh, later weapons. Which are pretty kick ass. Anyway, I'm going to be ending it right here. Sadly. <laughs> uh, I do enjoy this game a lot. So uh, I'll see you all in the next uh, part of this. And I hope you enjoy it. So yeah. Thank you all for watching, leave a like if you like this, subscribe if you want to, and remember that the choice is yours. Bye bye everyone!